Hello, this is Andy Rag. Uh, welcome to my channel. Um, I just thought I'd make a quick video on uh, a device I've knocked up uh, to assist me in repairing and uh, analysing fault finding on guitar amplifiers. So, um, first of all, a few uh, shouts out to a couple of other YouTube characters. Uh, firstly, Uncle Doug. Um, he knows who he is and uh, just like to thank him personally for uh, for all the uh, inspiration he's given me. Uh, long may it continue. And secondly, Terry Dayton of uh, D Labs for uh, for basically responding to uh, questions and comments and requests for uh, for videos um, and the swift turnaround thereof. Uh, really appreciate that, guys. So what we got here? Uh, well, this is a, a dummy load, and I built this in response to uh, Terry Dayton's video on. Uh, how to use an oscilloscope to uh, to basically check um, the signal in uh, or coming out of a guitar amplifier. So essentially, what you uh, what you need to do is you could either use a speaker cabinet, or uh, if that's going to get a bit loud for you, uh, use a dummy load. So essentially, inject a signal into your amplifier, run it through this dummy load and uh, use your oscilloscope to measure the output from the pins on the on the resistors here. So what have we got? Okay, we've got a piece, a piece of um, off-cut MDF board, about half inch thick. Uh, on the left here, we've got two 50 watt, 8 ohm resistors. And they're just wired up in series to, to this. Uh, I've checked that. And on this side we've got two 4 ohm 50 watt resistors. Um, again, wired up with a bit of a bit of flex onto a mono guitar jack. And uh, essentially plug this into your speaker output and um, in lieu of a speaker. And you can run a, a signal using a either a custom made signal generator or if you're tight like me um, <laughs> you can buy an app or get an app for free from Google Play and uh, that will allow you to generate tones on your phone and these then can be output via a 3.5mm jack into the front of your guitar amplifier and uh, generate some audio tones put those through the amp and pick them up on these prods here and here so that's about it. I just thought I'd share that with you. Once again, thanks to uh, the people I've already mentioned for uh, their help and assistance. And uh, hopefully I'll be posting a few more videos uh, in the near future. Okay, cheers.